He's like playing, basically. It's like, ooh, cars, smash. I was kind of like, wait, what? Mag Magnum PI? Like, they're gonna redo the show? I was a little bit thrown by it. How do you update it? How do you make it feel fresh? How do you make it feel new? How do you take what was uh, great about the original and, and sort of, you know, give it to another uh, younger, new audience? I thought to myself, there's no, there aren't any females, as far as I can remember, like, significant. Um, and, then, so, and then I kept reading and it said, um, they're reimagining John Higgins as Juliet Higgins, and I thought, okay, this could be really cool. You know, these guys were all in a uh, POW camp together in Afghanistan. They escaped from the camp. That sort of is where they form their brotherhood. And there's this mysterious writer, Robin Masters. He sets them up in Hawaii, and that's sort of the loose basis of the show. Our second episode, we're looking for a fish. Or it starts off with, uh, you know, rescuing some lady's uh, cat from a tree, but then it just, like, spirals out of control. They pitched this great idea for, for a character that would kind of go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Magnum, and that was a huge selling point, but more, more than that, it was, you know, the fact that it's Magnum. Higgins, close your eyes! I knew people were going to have opinions, and I was like conscious of that. I was conscious of the, the question of the mustache. I knew it was going to be ever-present, which it is. And I thought it was a smart thing to, to not do it, because you're never going to replace Tom Selleck. So you had to do something that, was, that felt different, you know? Taking what worked from the original character in the show and, and trying to infuse this uh, you know, sort of new, fresh idea with that. We end up helping him out, but he also helps us out, you know? So it's like the kind of thing that keeps you watching as you go. She can't help Thomas Magnum's charm, and he pulls her into, into his I think like... she's just got some skills that he needs <laughs> by being so incredibly incompetent. That's how she rationalizes uh, her assistance. But she, you know, some part of her wants to help because it's kind of fun.